Hello and welcome to West Country Wanderings. Today we're doing a short bite here at Sharpness Docks and I'll just show you the view that is behind me. Slightly misty this morning but we're looking down the Gloucester Sharpness Canal. I've mentioned that a couple of times before. A few boats on the canal and that turret there is all that remains of the former Severn Bridge, the railway bridge that linked Sharpness to the town of Lydney in the Forest of Dean. It's an interesting story how that came to no longer be there. I won't uh, give you all that now because I'm sure that'll be on a future vlog. To the left of that is the River Severn. But why are we here? Sharpness Docks is situated where the Gloucester to Sharpness Canal meets the River Severn. So below that, that's where it becomes navigable. Well, to a fashion, it's a dangerous river, as we'll see in future vlogs. But uh, the reason we're here today is today is an open day for a charity called SARA, S-A-R-A. -A. So we've got some uh, <laughs> large geese going over in formation at the moment. <laughs> Yeah, SARA, it stands for Seven Area Rescue Association and they're a bit like the RNLI except it's for the inland waterway and river and they cover the stretch between Bristol which is about 15-20 miles to the south of me at the moment up to Kidderminster in Worcestershire right in the again on the River Severn uh, which is about I think is about 15-20 miles north of Worcester between Worcester uh, slightly to the west of uh, uh, Worcester between Worcester and Birmingham and so they cover that stretch of the River Severn it can be a very very treacherous river at times during all that stretch particularly to the to, to do with the tides and to do with the mud they've got an open day here today to tell the public more about the sort of things that they do and also to raise funds for the important work they do rescuing people that use the river and the canal so why not join me and we'll have a look and an explore to see learn more about Sara because I'd not heard of them before today so uh, we'll learn together and see what they do. So here we are back down on the uh, shoreline of the River Severn and uh, river line, shoreline, not quite sure which. Just had a quick look around the docks here and uh, when I arrived at the event today I was given this leaflet. So I'll just uh, read a little bit for you to give you a little bit background to uh, what SARA is all about. It stands for the Severn Area Rescue Association and it's the Britain's second largest rescue uh, after the RNLI course which you'll be very familiar with and I'm certainly familiar with as I used to work in Brixham. It was established in 1973 and they have six lifeboat and rescue stations and 200 volunteer crew members. Now just remember that none of these members are paid. They have regular jobs. They could be farmers, they could be builders, they could be office workers, shop workers. That's their main job. They're constantly on call to give their lives really to rescue other people that have become trapped here on the River Severn and also on the canal.
port of Sharpness still very much a working port as it has been for numerous years, mainly now dealing with scrap metal but also to do with container shipping and also there are various light industries in this fascinating area where the canal meets the tidal river. Standing next to these old railway trucks, just see this one was built in Darlington in the northeast in 1949 for British Railways. There was a project to open a preserved line here. There is a branch line which joins up to the main Bristol to Birmingham line at a place called Barclay Road, and a lot of the track is still extant. And there's various bits of old locomotives and trucks and uh, shunters, that kind of thing. Just taken one. It used to be used by the Central Electricity Generating Board. I'm not sure if there's plans to continue with it. It does look a little bit forlorn at the moment, so maybe it's just been mothballed for pending funds, but it'd be an exciting project to see steam trains back running along the line, which connected up to the Severn Railway Bridge and joined this part of Gloucestershire into the Forest of Dean. Anyway, that's all we have time for on this short bite on West Country Wanderings for today. I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about Sara and the important rescue work that they do. It was all new to me. I didn't, hadn't heard of them until uh, late yesterday. Learned a little bit more this morning and lots as I've visited the open day here today. I've uh, really, really enjoyed it. I hope you have too. If you like this sort of thing, then please consider a subscribe, uh, perhaps a like. If you hit the bell as well, then YouTube will notify you of when the next video I have uploads. If it's the first one you've seen, I do various formats of videos. This is one of the shorter ones. I also do longer formats where I explore specific places in more detail and I also do day walking ones as well. Uh, have a look at my channel. There is a trailer there which explains more about it. Anyway, until next time, hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you all again soon. Take care of yourselves. Cheers. Bye bye for now.